Merry Christmas, everyone. This is Carl talking. Today is 24th day of December, 1950. We are celebrating a free Christmas dinner at Mom and Pop's house. Those present to indulge in the famous art of eating a large 20-pound turkey are Bud and Eula, Dale and Margie, Jimmy, Helen, and Jenny Lou, myself, Nan, Richard, William, and Shirley Ann, and of course, Mom and Pop. Merle was asked, but had to turn the offer down. Margie and Dale came in from Baltimore yesterday afternoon, which was Saturday, and Jimmy came in Monday, last Monday, from Philadelphia, where he is going to a medical technician school. Helen and Jenny Lou have been stranded here since Thanksgiving due to the deep snow. They were here waiting. The menu includes turkey and dressing, sweet potatoes, mince pie, salad, cottage cheese, lima beans, mashed potatoes, cranberry sauce, fruit cake, rolls, and ice cream. Mom has the table spread out the full length seated in her kitchen instead of in the dining room, the old dining room. Now everyone has been seated at the table with heads bowed waiting for Pop to return thanks. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you that thou hast taken care of us through another year, and that thou hast made it possible for us to enjoy this meal together. Bless his food to the nourishment of each one of our bodies. Forgive us of all of our sins and save us through Christ. Amen. Richard, will you also give thanks? Yes, sir. God is good and God is great, and we thank him for our food. Bow our heads and let us be fair. Give us our daily, our daily bread. Amen. Willie, do you want to give thanks? God is good and God is great. Thank him for our food. I think that's how it goes, isn't it? You're supposed to be giving a prayer at the table. I know, but I don't know. Michelle, how to start over. God is good. God is great. Thank you for our food. Bow our heads. Let's, let's be fair. Amen. Give us a day our daily bread. Amen. Oh,